I found a $3 Mora ripoff at Walmart, and you're not gonna believe the quality. Let's get into it. What's up everybody, this is Derek from Derek Bushcraft, and today I wanna to talk about the $3 Mora ripoff from Walmart. Um, if you know anything about uh, Mora knives, um, they are some of the best quality, cheapest knives you can possibly get, especially when you're starting in bushcraft. Um, these knives are absolutely great. This is the Companion. I paid 15, 20 bucks or something like that on Amazon for it. Absolutely amazing knives. If you're just starting out, get a Mora. They are, are great little workhorses. Um, highly recommended by not just myself, but tons and tons of people who, uh, who have much better knives than these but still recommend these knives. It's, it's kind of crazy. So um, if you know anything about Walmart, Walmart has tried to get into the outdoor um, game for a while now. Well, they've been in it um, <clears throat> with their brand of Ozark Trail uh, equipment. And I went into Walmart the other day and I happened up on the fishing aisle and I was just looking for some random things. And I noticed two giant boxes full of what appeared at first to be Mora's and I got a little giddy. So I ran up to them real quick and immediately I realized they were not Mora's, they were some sort of offshoot of a Mora. Um, and the price tag was $2.87. So they have a little zip tie around them and so I asked one of the employees there if he could open one up so I could check out the blade and he obliged and we opened one up and I said I'll take three. Now these are absolutely horrible knives. <laughs> I mean, okay, so here's the whole package. Here's what you get, all right? $2.87. You, you can't really beat a $2.87 Mora ripoff um, until you actually get into the nitty gritty. So that is the actual blade. Um, it's probably some sort of really cheap stainless steel. Uh, their website doesn't say what it is, it just says durable steel blade and this, this is advertised as a bait knife um it was our trail bait knife or fish knife with a comfortable molded plastic handle and your clip-on sheath that's also made of plastic um this thing is is the almost opposite of a mora so in, instead of being a rat tang where the, the tang gets smaller and comes to about here on a mora this tang actually is only to about here. It's really, really small tang, and I, I found that out by watching another YouTube video after I bought the thing. Um, very small tang, so these have a, a very good chance of breaking. Uh, also, the blade is dull. <laughs> I mean, if you're expecting a more quality blade, you're, you're sadly gonna be mistaken. Um, <clears throat> however, $2.87, I bought three. I threw one in my car, I got one right here, and I have another one. I don't know why. Uh, maybe it's like the knife collector that's that's trying to get out. It's like three dollars for a knife. You can't you can't pass that up. You know. I spent nine dollars and I got three knives. Just I mean, they're not horrible, horrible knives. I mean, they're 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 something, I suppose. Um, if a fifteen dollar Mora is out of your budget, then a three dollar knife should be within your budget. Um, it is called the uh, Walmart OTWBKA, if you're interested in the, the serial number. I highly doubt I'm gonna be able to get a, a clear shot of that serial number, so forgive me. Um, but this, I just, I had to buy them and I had to tell you guys about them because, I mean, where, where can you find a knife for $3 that looks like a Mora. I mean, you could pass this bad boy off as a Mora to, to unsuspecting. Doesn't have that Mora click, you know, there's that, it just kind of squishes in there. Whereas the Mora, you know, the Moras will kind of have this little like clicky thud. These Walmart ones, they just kind of squish. They're, they're, they're just shoved in there, you know, and held in by tension of the sheath, I guess. Um, I tried to sharpen this knife I tried for quite a while and I did make it sharper, but it didn't seem like it wanted to get sharp. And it's it's kind of like a fake Scandi grind in a sense that it does have the Scandi bevel on each side, but then there's a, a very big 
micro bevel at the bottom that just doesn't really you know do very good um, this thing will not cut paper it's not razor sharp like Amora it will not just slice through paper like butter but hey three bucks two dollars and 87 cents even you got some change left over uh, get them at Walmart go to the fishing section they only had black I mean you know that's one of the cool things about Mora is you can get a ton of colors if you're into that whatever to match your personality they only have black blacks fine um, I, I just I bought three I don't know why I bought three but I was just like I'll take three and so I mean I spent less than nine dollars and I got three knives <laughs> so they're not very good um, let's be honest the 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 quality is lacking pretty much everywhere. The, the handle is quite comfortable though. I mean, it's, it's a good size handle. It's, they definitely were taking some tips from Mora because they, it's a nice handle, but the tang goes to here. And it, it kind of has like this little like curl, if you will, inside the tang. And the back can sharp, or can strike a, a fire steel though. That's one thing it has over Mora. It's, Right out of the box, the this $3 one can, can strike a fire steel, whereas my Mora, I had to file down the edge just to get it to sharpen, but it's also sharp. I can cut things with it. This is, I don't even know what you would use this for. These are like throwaway knives. You know, you use them real quick, you beat the crap out of them, throw them away, uh, which is quite wasteful, but, or you give them to gifts to sad people. I don't know what you do with them. I bought three. There we are. Um, so that is the Walmart Ozark Trail bait and fishing knife. $2.87 at Walmart in the fishing section. Um, pick yourself up a couple dozen of these bad boys and just toss them around the world. You know, who cares? Or just go and get a Mora. You know, I, I mean, do what you got to do. Uh, I, I like Mora um, myself. I like, you know, Condor. I like Joker. I like those kind of brands. Uh, Ozark Trail has consistently made absolute rubbish, so that's kind of cool. Um, they're continuing that long generation of just making garbage products. Uh, but that's Walmart for you, and that's why you're paying $2.87. You can't really complain for the price tag. Um, you can just compare. And so, well, that's it. So uh, go ahead and uh, like, comment, subscribe, do all that cool stuff. Uh, I appreciate it, and uh, I'll see you next time.